guys and welcome back to another video i'm about to make my cocoa and then today's agenda is to put up the lights also do some diy projects you have to keep watching to see what those diy projects are i think i may do my living room so i think this may be like a part one part two just depends on how long the video is but that is what is on the agenda for today so let's go ahead and get into this video getting the lights up on the house he is at the highest peak of the house look at him good job babe only thing i'm looking at is like how he go every christmas baby Flowers are finally blooming. Because I think when I did my fall video, they had not bloomed, but we are finally getting some buds, guys. Okay, guys, so I am in my garage. I'm about to get ready to paint my nutcrackers. So what I'm about to do now is just get some paper put down and then get to painting. I'm gonna let that dry for a couple of hours and then I'm gonna move on to the next project. So I have my nutcrackers laid down, all right. I wanna use this bare paint. This is antique brass, it's in satin metallic. I did read the instructions, one to two coats. Also make sure that whatever you're painting, the surface has been wiped down so that the paint adheres properly. Okay. I'll start with the legs first. I wish upon a falling star So all your secret dreams can come true There's something that happens on slate There's a ring in it And December is when the children are singing yeah. Merry Christmas, baby so you can't really, really see, see the color, but I'm gonna let this dry, because it's supposed to look like this color, but it's just the light. What we're doing now, we are in the um, great room, the former area here. I already did the prep work, cleaning, vacuuming, dusting, all of that. So the only thing that we're going to do is just bring the decor pieces in. And as I bring those decor pieces in, I am going to be telling you where I got those items from. This beautiful cream pillowcase. I did purchase this from Amazon. I did get a set of two for $24.99. I did have this in my fall decor. And so the only thing that I'm doing is using it as a transitional piece for my living room. This is a lovely blue velvet pillow. This is the original covering that came when I purchased the couch, which will bring a nice cool tone to the space. All right, this beautiful throw here, I purchased from TJ Maxx. Look how beautiful that texture is. This is, the brand is DKNY, and this was $19.99, and I'm going to be adding this.
So the next pillow that we have is the lumbar pillow. I definitely love this pillow. It's very clean, very classy. It still brings Christmas into the room. If you don't want to have a lot of Christmas pillows all over your couch, this is simple, but yet makes a big statement as well. Over here we have the infamous vase that are in everyone's videos. I did purchase this from Target. Um, I think at the time, let me see if it still has the price tag on it. It does. This was $29.99. And these beautiful stems I did purchase from Hobby Lobby. Everything was 50% off the Christmas decor. It literally brings Christmas into your space. It gives a more natural yet realistic feel to your space. So what I'm gonna do now is just add a few more pieces to the space just to give it a little bit more Christmas feel. The first thing that I'm gonna add to this space is this beautiful snowman. I have a thing for snowmans. I don't know, but I'm always drawn to the snowman. And I think this is definitely elegant, also very nice. And I did add the potpourri um, fragrance in here. I did purchase the fragrance, you can't see it, but I purchased this from Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, or Ross. I really can't, I don't have the tag on it, but this is so beautiful. The next thing I'm gonna to bring to the space, just to bring a little bit of that kid feeling into this space, because I do have two young children, um, is this beautiful snowman. Oh, I love the texture of this. I love the snowflakes on it. I thought it was absolutely stunning, so I did decide to purchase this. I've had it for, um, this is the second Christmas I've had with this. I think I got this from Hobby Lobby. I don't remember the price tag on this. Okay, so now that I have the table like I wanted, not too much, but still giving Christmas as I stated, um, simple but minimal, I'm gonna go ahead and add something here to kind of bring this area together. I'm gonna add this beautiful wicker basket. I did purchase this from Ross. Let me tell you, the quality is definitely there. This definitely brings and ties into that Christmas feel, so I'm gonna add it here in this space. Alright, so the next thing that I'm going to be adding in this space is this beautiful lantern that I got from Home Depot quite a few years ago. And I got it for less than $30. It's absolutely stunning. It's huge. This has been outside of my home in front of the doorstep, but this year I'm going to be adding it to the inside of my home. I did add a candle in here to turn it on at night. I think it gives off a nice ambience for the space. And then I just added these beautiful bells that I got from like the dollar store. And I thought that it tied in very nicely with what I'm doing for this area. This is the infamous tray that everyone has from Target. I absolutely love this tray and the price tag on this oversized tray is $39.99. I don't think I paid $39.99 for it. I think I had like a, it was on sale or something. But anyway, I'm going to be adding this tray to this table. I call this a transitional piece. You can use it wherever I think it's good for any season. Um, it's just how you decorate it. So let's get started. 
All right, next up is this beautiful wreath. It's just a simple, plain wreath. I did get this from Hobby Lobby's. The price tag is still on here. This was um, $17.99. I'm gonna take this off, but it wasn't 17. That's just the original price. I got it for 50% off, so I'm gonna be adding it to this tray. Alright, so I'm going to now add these beautiful cherries. I got these from Hobby Lobby's a couple of years ago. Okay. Alright, so I think I like this look for what I'm doing with it. So now I'm going to add these beautiful candle holders. I did purchase these from Amazon. I think they were like $15.99. I am gonna add all three in this tray. All right, so now I'm gonna add these battery-operated candles. They do imitate real light candles. I purchased this reindeer at Hobby Lobby's for like $7.99, but it was 50% off. I'm gonna add books back to my table because I do like to look through my books when I am sitting here. So I'm gonna add this book that I got from Amazon. Um, this is A Place to Call Home. And I think the price on this was less than 15 or $20, so I'm gonna add this to the space. Add back this beautiful magnifying glass. I did get this from Amazon for like $16. I just like the antique look of it, so I'm gonna just add this to the space. I'm just gonna add two books. This is the mid-century modern decor book. It's empty, nothing's in it. You can write notes in it if you want for ideas, but it's really just a table book, really, to look at it. And I think this was less than um, $20 as well. The final touch, I'm just gonna add back my coasters, but I'm gonna put it on this table with the book, and that will complete the table. 